Alright guys, clones and brigs, and guess what? I'm back and better than ever. Well, I've been gone for an extremely long amount of time, and it's about time I do updates. A lot of updates. Uh, let's see, where should I start? I'll start out on the bench. I just cleaned this up tonight. Alright, first thing I'll start with is this stereo system. Just got this a couple days ago, got it for free. Uh, my dad was flipping a house, uh, like, you know, like, renovating it and everything, and uh, they gave me this. It's a stereo receiver, it's sharp, SA250, two huge speakers that work perfect, and a tape deck. It also allows you to plug in, in the back, like, uh, with two cables, like, um, like, aux, like, AUX, or, like, a CD player, stuff like that, plug in your iPod. I haven't done that yet, but I know it works because I already tried it real quick, but it gets really loud. I can't turn it up because it's like 1 in the morning, but um, I got the, yeah, that's free, and that's my new thing, my new stereo for out here. It's real good. Second is um, the Still TS400 Chop Saw. This is not mine, unfortunately. It would be cool if it was, but I'm actually uh, rebuilding this for a dad or for my friend's dad. Uh, I need to complete motor rebuild. I'll uh, show you guys the motor. Completely taken apart. Um, a guy at his work ran four cycle through it after it ran out of gas and didn't know that it was a two cycle motor. So uh, he cooked the top end and the bottom end. The bearings are still usable, um, but I need to order a new new top and bottom end. If you can see, right here is the connecting rod. Well, I'll try and show you. As you can see, it moves back and forth, and you're not here, but it, you can barely see, but it moves up and down, and the bearings are shot. So, that's with that, and then the piston... The rings were cooked in it, and the piston is shot. You can't really see it, but that is bad. So he wants me to order that and put that all together. So that's what I've been doing right there. The KX60. <laughs> oh God, I still didn't order the piston and rings, but I did the whole bottom end, and it's perfect. I got the old piston in there, no rings, just piston. But I'm doing piston and rings, it's all together, so hopefully that'll run when it's done. Um, let me grab this. This is my side project that I've been working on for a while. It's uh, my next racing tractor. Um, I might not even be keeping this one because it's so like far gone, I might be rebuilding that this one this old one uh, this is the Murray you can't really tell cause there's nothing left of it really it's all stripped sorry for the poor lighting but Murray all stripped down no transmission everything is gone the motor this motor I hate it guess what it's Tecumseh and this proves why Tecumseh went out of business. They, I'm just saying, I don't like them personally. I'm hopefully getting a Briggs, Briggs muffler on it. <laughs> um, but yeah, that motor's nothing but trouble. Here's my one Peerless. This is the one that I pulled out that's probably going back in. This is the one that I pulled out of that motor right there. And this is another Peerless that came out of the, came out of the Murray. Um, this I have to say I gotta give props to to uh, Tecumseh for building the transmissions because they're real good. I like them. Um, but yeah, that's that. Um, here's a lawnmower that I got for free. That's our personal mower now. It's a Toro. Super Cycle Pro. It was just sitting and the guy didn't want it. He gave it to us. It works perfect. Except the first day. Uh, and I broke that the cable snaps so I gotta get a new cable this is the 11 horsepower Briggs that I said I loved and as you can see it has a very large hole in the block 
And there's an old bike frame. Another identical 12 horse to come. So for that one, these decks. If anybody, anybody needs a deck, just tell me. I'll give you a real good deal. This deck, there's no rot, no holes. Same for that one. That one came off the Murray wide body. There's no holes. The belt on it is still good. Uh, this one could use a new belt, but it's usable. Everything spins on it free. Oh, look at that spider right there. <laughs> All right, that's what I've been doing there. Um, a lot of you guys don't know, but I BMX. So here's my BMX bike. But uh, this is just one video. I'm going to make probably a couple more tonight of those two motors down there. So, uh, yep, I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.